we are going to be touring my old island. And I know you might be thinking, wait, what? You have a camera. Yeah, I do. And it's not a great camera. It's actually my iPhone camera. And I apologize for how bad this video is going to be because I'm testing out if I hate doing this or not so that if I go and I buy a good camera and a good mic that I don't hate having my face everywhere before I do that, if that makes any sense. So um, I do wanna to be touring my old island. I just realized that I don't know what the code is. So that's just fantabulous. So I'm gonna go to my house. I'm pretty sure it'll let me go to an old dream that I've been to before because I, I did look to see if what I had done was anything worth showing because I couldn't really remember if I had saved the dream address at any good point. Um, but looking at it, this island is not as good as I thought it was going to be. Oh, apparently I had a different code on my bed before. I don't know how well this is going to work out, but if the video doesn't work, the video doesn't work. This does work. Great. Because I did not, I forgot what the code for my old dream address was. Um, when I first got this, my island, I named it NL because I was so unsure of what to name it. Um, I named it that because my boyfriend's name is Nick and my name is Lena. Um, very, 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 very shortly after I named this, I was very upset. Um, and I wanted my island to be called Half Moon so badly. Thankfully, this island that I am doing now is called Half Moon and I got to fulfill my dreams. But what we're going to do is we're going to go to the entrance first. So I had a blue airport, which I low-key miss. I don't like the color of my airport now. Um, and let's look at the map, actually. This is NL. Um, this is unfinished only by, I think, one area. But I did change a lot of this up. If you want to see speed builds I did on this island, go on my um, earlier first posted videos. One of my most popular videos is actually from this island. So I have ketchup. Raymond, Bob, Tia, Tangy, Whitney, Maple, Scoot, Cherry, and Stitches. I'm pretty sure the only villager I wanted to get out at this point in time was Whitney. So this is my entrance. Um, this island is supposed to be cottagecore themed. This entrance is pretty cool for like 2020 Animal Crossing. Now it's kind of just cringy and annoying and extra. But when you go up, this is the resident services. I literally just threw like a million codes and a million flowers down. There's nothing surrounding it. And it's just uneven and uncentered. But we're going to go to the left. This speed build right here, believe it or not, is my most popular video on my channel to date. Um, anyways, then I have this little tiki bar. Um, it doesn't really fit. I literally kind of just did whatever. This isn't even decorated. Um, this code on the back is good. I feel like this is not a bad build. It just doesn't make sense for my island. I kind of felt like I just wanted to. This is my favorite build on this whole entire island. It's this little, I guess this is a butterfly garden but this took a decent amount of time because I had to get all the butterfly models and hyacinth lamps and stuff like that. Like that wasn't that easy when you first started playing the game. And I have this little picnic area. I used to think this, this area was so beautiful. I don't really like this path. I think that's what's ruining it for me is I just don't like the path. And then if you go over here, more of this ugly path I don't like. I really just threw a lot of stuff around attempting to make areas. Um, and you go up here, 
this is my little garden. These flowers don't even match on the right side or even the left side. Everybody had an orchard when they first made their islands. It was like a popular thing, a very simple, basic orchard. Like you could tell that this is a 2020 island, 150%. Honestly, like this actually makes me happy. Like, cause since this sucks so bad and I look at my island now and I'm like, wow, I've improved a lot. And then you go up here and I have my museum. Also another basic build, but it's still nice. Like it doesn't look necessarily bad. And then over here we have my house which I actually think is decorated. I feel like I took the time to do this. Well, and my pre Happy Home Paradise heart would be screaming. Apparently I did. I mean, if this is what I thought, I remember doing the inside of my house and I feel like that's just not great. What? This doesn't even make sense. Why is there an OK Motors sign, a fountain, and a stone lion dog? Just why? And the, the fencing placement and everything. And then I have two different... It's me. That's weird. And then this bridge in the middle just kind of goes back to my and services over here. I have a weird little outside library. I thought that this was like the coolest build ever when I first did it. And then this is the only thing I didn't finish. I don't remember what I ha used to have here. It looks like it was gonna be some sort of another restaurant. I am honestly really not too sure. Maybe if we go into, we do some spying on my old videos, we'll figure out what this used to be. But then on the other side, there's a little theater. This was like prime, okay? This build was prime in 2020 and I was a god. None of this is decorated up here, these cliffs. I'm pretty sure it, it is decorated like when I finished the island. I love when no cranny looks like this, it's so cute. And then you go over here, this is the coolest build on my whole island. Like today, I still stand by this build. It's like a little island for Abel Sisters. I remember building this and being like, wow, I am like so amazing. And then this just leads back to where my house was. Instead of like actually putting things, I kind of just put like a ridiculous amount of paths and called it a day. And over here is another thing I did on my island where I was kind of like, yeah, it's okay to just throw things and make them areas. I have a little space area. Yes, this stuff is cool. Does it make sense? No. This stone here is adorable. Um, I know that I have this little like somewhat, I guess it's like a perspective garden is what it's supposed to be. It's not decorated, it's ugly, and it makes no sense. I need those cherry blossom lanterns now, wish I could steal them. And up here is my neighborhood. This I still stand by as well, I like this little area over here this butterfly is gorgeous the heart pond we love her she's adorable also was a crazy thing in 2020 like everyone had a freaking heart pond adorable still stand by that and then i had this little i put i just threw everyone's houses together because i thought that was effective i definitely don't do that anymore it's still cute but i just feel like it's too much and then this is where red would come so i have a little sign and then over here is the campsite. This is actually still cute. I still like this. Also, for some reason, just have a million flowers separating this. But this is just, anyone actually stay here? Oh. The little paw prints on the ground right here are adorable. I'm not gonna lie. Honestly, that's really it. 
since 95% of my island is just this awful path, it's just something's about it is weird. I don't know. I like the pumpkin path though. I don't know why I have two different paths. You can kind of see they're slightly different colors. I don't know why I did that. You could really see it here. But I like this one. Not this one. But that's okay. All right, guys. This is the end of the video. I hope you enjoyed. I'm sorry that it's so short. I'm sorry that my island sucks. But like I said, I think you should take a look at my new island. My dream address is in the description of my Instagram, which I'll put on the screen now. Um, seeing the improvement is great. I love that this island sucks because if this island didn't suck, then it would show that I had no improvement. My island would be the same, you know? I really like my island right now. I'm really excited to finish it. It's Japanese themed. So please go check it out. I think you'll like it. I think you'll enjoy it. I also did a tour of another Japanese island. So if you're looking for a lot of inspiration, I have that. Please, 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 please like and subscribe. Subscribing is free and it helps me out a lot. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Bye-bye. Thank you.